Well, howdy ho, good neighbor. Today I'm at an undisclosed location, and as you can see, there was some fire sprinkler main in the way up there. They're gonna be adding some duck where that insulation is tore out. So that three inch main up there went straight across, but not today. Today I had to offset it. I'm filling it up now, so there is no water coming. So we're feeling good right now. But there you go, one three inch offset. And you can see that that drop is too far away from the wall, but later when they get their ceiling in, we'll figure out how to get that drop over. Okay, so there's one for your pleasure. Now, it's almost noon and I gotta fill that up. And uh, I got one more to do. But you know, they will try to kill you. They want you to do it all in one day. And I don't think I can. Well, I know I can't. I'd be here 12 hours. So here's the next one that I need to do. I'll show you right where I need to be. So tomorrow, that three inch main way up there needs to be relocated right there. You see it. So I'm going to get that main away from this wall. And the X marks the spot on the ground, supposedly. That's the edge of it. So, all right, I should have enough pipe for that. All right. Well, as always, I want to thank you for coming along with me on these little adventures. You remember the long drops? Well, that's where I'm at. So if you put two and two together, don't drop the long drop. All right, there you go. Three inch main relocate <laughs> times two. But I only got one done today. A lot of trapped water. Oh yeah, I moved that inch and a half. You could see that inch and a half line right there. Yeah, that was running through there too. So I had to move that and cap it over there. Let's go fill up that system. All right, as always, I'd like to thank you again for coming along with me on these little adventures. Peace, love, and all that hippie jazz. Well, howdy ho, good neighbor. Today, I just finished the loop around. That's correct. I will show you what I did today. I know everybody likes to see me work. But a lot of times I can't show you my secrets. And the truth to be told, I'm so unsure of myself, I don't know if it's gonna work. But for some reason, it always does. So let me turn on your old flashlight, turn you around and you will see what I did today. This piece of pipe used to go right straight through way over there. But they're having an air conditioning unit cut out. So I had the, you could see my hangers right there. So I had to relocate that three inch main way over there, way over here, right back to there. So there you go, a three inch loop around, the water is on. Everything is dry. This is always a good feeling at the end of the day when everything is dry, you could see I'm working around holes. There's holes everywhere, which is very dangerous. I put that fan right there so I wouldn't fall into the hole. I had to tear that plastic down a little bit just to get to that big way over there. And I got this million dollar object just sitting here. So a lot of hazards to relocate one 24 foot piece of pipe. And you can see that the dust is pretty bad here. All right. Someday I want to do your job. Because this job is just too nerve wracking. But be careful what you wish for, because I'm not a good nurse. 
All right, you know the drill. As always, I want to thank you for coming along with me on these little adventures. You know the drill. Peace, love, and all that hippie jazz. Thanks again. Postscript, I heard this person down there washing their hands and I heard running water. It scared the bejesus out of me. Bejesus?